It's another freezing winter day and the soups are on in the kitchen at the chef's table in Fairfield, a restaurant on the post road where rock posters and album covers line the walls and the food is worthy of note. For $6, a customer can get a 16 ounce serving of chowder and Rhode Island chowder is one of the main callings. Um, we do 14 hot soups a day and uh, chowder is a big piece of it. Uh, when you have 14 hot soups, you've got to have some chowder, you've got to have some broth soups, bean soups, and really kind of mix it up. So uh, chowders are, again, a big piece. We have seafood, ch you know, a, a seafood chowder, which is a mix of shrimp and fish. We have uh, Rhode Island clam chowder, which is a either thickened or not thickened, uh, non-creamed soup, chowder. Uh, and it's 16 ounces for six dollars. 16 ounces for six bucks, and uh, how big of a cellar is it for you? It's a huge cellar. We're about 80 gallons of of chowder a week, um, and uh, you know, especially when it's really cold out, like it is today, and uh, it's a big piece. I'm going to throw in my onions. My celery, chopped celery. And we're going to let that cook for a little while until they get a little bit tender. Get that bacon flavor right into the onions and celery. Uh, we've been here at this location for six years. Uh, we were in Westport for 14 years. Um, and uh, this is our big location and our only existing location at this point. Rhode Island chowder is a popular Connecticut style, probably because Connecticut is on the cusp of, of both New England and New York. And Rhode Island is perceived as an alternative to the creaminess of New England style chowder and the tomato base of the Manhattan style. This is Tony Spinelli, Compost.com.